guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode 23 of the Aqua Top and White Sands. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one. Hold on. Three, two, one, go. Alrighty. What happened in the second to last episode? Aww. Looks really good. <laughs> Aww. And it's still there. Something tells me it's not going to leave until the final episode. Trap circles and over here. Where is it? It's over there. I mean, which it makes sense, but because this came out yesterday, and whatever the heck is probably going on in this episode, I ain't gonna know. And then whatever the heck comes out next week with the finale, I ain't gonna know because I'm probably gonna have work on that day, and I probably won't get home until probably four or five o'clock in the afternoon. Um, so <laughs> yeah. I'm going to try to get the finale out on that day, but like I said, I, I I don't know what time I'm getting home on Thursday if I have to work, but if I don't have to work, I will get it out as soon as possible. If I do, I will get it out probably two hours after I get home, because of course I got to do stuff when I get home as well. I got to take Cody out. Um, I think, oh no, because see, that's smart. Yeah, I can check the mail on my way back home from work. Yes, I don't have to always go ahead and take my dog out and go check the mail. Uh, except when it comes, mm, probably when it comes to weekends, but I won't know until I get my schedule on Monday. Mm -hmm. Hold on, I gotta right there. What are my notifications? Oh. So I wonder who's all going to do this. Yeah. Fuka, what about you?
Mm. You probably could. No, Fuka, you want to go. <gasps> yeah! I like how her living room is just simple. Sometimes simple is good. Do you think you can handle that? No, I don't think it's that. I think, you know, you had the greatest potential. And you did good. You did the best of your abilities. But maybe he wants you to move on forward in your career. Huh? Really? Oh. Hmm? Is Kai ever listening to them? Oh yeah, because today should be your last day, right? For now, you know. <laughs> hmm. 
Mm. <gasps> Look at this! Yeah! Oh my god! She's going to go by the end of this. And so let's say the last episode does like a flash forward two years and we get to see them when they're older. Like, oh, I would love that. All right, Fuka. Mm, it might not. Oh.
Cody! The question is, how many can they take? Can they just take the five, or... Seemed like it was five people. Mm Mm-hmm. But it was still educational, though. Exactly, because you know, at a young age, kids want to be everything, you know? Which is good. True. Oh, baby. Why? Yes, you can. Oh, I know how she feels. Oh, babe. Really? I honestly thought she was going to move on from it. You're right. Because you got to stand on your own. Oh, Foka. No, oh, honey. Yeah, but you want to do it, right? So you can't give up on this opportunity that you've gotten. Who knows when you'll be able to get it again? Mm-hmm. Oh, Fuka! Oh. 
I'm gonna buy that figure of them. I I'm gonna do it. I don't know when they're gonna sell it, but I'm gonna buy it. That is the goal. God, this feels like the last episode, even though we have one more left. Oh, babies. This will be good for them. It, it really, truly will be. I mean, yeah, it is hard to not see someone every single day, especially now for two years. I mean, it's going to hurt. It, it's truly going to fucking hurt. And I feel bad for them because I want them to see each other every single day. They're, like, as she said, you know, I'll be your big sister from now on. It, it seemed more like, they both needed each other. Ever since the beginning of this show, they've both kind of relied on each other ever since. And, like I said, what I am hoping for with the final episode next week, I do want to see, like, not, not, yeah, Kokoro doing her thing in marketing still. I'm still, I'm very freaking surprised that she decided to stay in marketing. Because you would think... After so many episodes she's been with marketing, she had one good break last week. She was, I thought she was going to be like, oh, I can move on? Done. I want it. But the fact is that she's staying means she really enjoys it and likes the challenge in a way. And so that she can improve on it. So I'm hoping that what they do end up doing, like the first half, we do see these two say their goodbyes to each other once again but then in the second half of the show for the final episode we do flash forward two years later when Fuka does eventually come back to um about Sagamagama <laughs> Tingata and they're able to see each other again Th there's a lot that they could do with this final episode I would like to see it not be 23 minutes kind of really more or less like probably 45 46 minutes because there is a lot that you can put in a final episode but do I think they're going to make it into a 45 46 episode possibly not um as much that's the same thing of how I feel like after watching the first episode of season two or the entertainment district arc for Demon Slayer and how that first episode was a 46 minute episode and I was shocked I was like damn like what the heck can you put in 46 minutes for an episode? And they put a lot in. And I was like, well, geez, can you just make the whole entire series for this season all an hour long? Because there's a lot that you could probably do. So I, I would like to see that for this show, at least be 45, 46 minutes long. Because I'm guessing there is a lot they need to put in this finale episode and such. It does, like feel like even though we haven't seen the final episode that there is a lot of unanswered questions I will really truly honestly say that it does feel like with certain characters even Kukuru and Fuka that we there's still like a lot missing um I'm glad that you know every single week we got to focus on everyone else but like when I go into next week and when I look at this show from episode one to this final episode and we, when we get down into the nitty gritty of each character and it's going to be like, are they still the same from episode one onwards or did they change? Plus with the new characters that we just met from episode 13 to the end of the series, did they change from the first time when they came on to now? It's going to be a lot of back and forth because some of it is yes, some of it is no. And I, I, honestly, I'm not mad at that. We're we're just going to have to wait and see. I mean, this was a very good second to last episode. I hate the fact that this is going to be over next week because everything is going to be over in these next few weeks. And I really hate that. And I hate that this, this whole year went by so freaking fast and we're already dang, like, so freaking close. Three, I'm a, like, by next week, it'll be three weeks and then we'll be done with 2021 and we'll be right into 22 and whatever the heck 2022 has in store for us but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episode 23 of the aqua top on white sand if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys hopefully like i said hopefully 
for um on next Thursday for the final episode um depending on what time I come back from work um if not I will have it either come out Friday later early Friday morning because it's now seven thirteen now and I still got one more thing to do um so either early Friday morning or if not Friday possibly Saturday but until then I will see you guys all next time bye